Hello. I'm Cloud Man. I never play. Majors here. That's my sister Mallory. And these two delicate young creatures are the reason why murdering teenagers became my sister Mallory's number one passion as a grown-up. She writes slasher films now. As for me, well, my life has been a little different. But we'll get to that later. What if we tell you about being on our side of the street? Yeah, I think we were pretty clear about it. This is the wrong side of the street for stupid nerds. <laughs> you realize that with some matching outfits and lame 50s music, you guys would be a Broadway show right now. Yes? I don't know what you just said, but it kind of made me feel like kicking your ass. Me too. Bullies and their victims. It's a story as old as time. Just two days prior, things had gotten really bad for Mallory. I was, of course, being my usual compassionate self. You can't keep your stupid mouth shut, can you? Nope, but why don't you be a hero and teach me? Well, I am. Okay, look. I have to tell you something. What? I don't want to get my ass kicked anymore. What the hell are you talking about get your ass kicked? People called you gay for exactly one week because you wore eyeliner and dressed like a vampire. You had it coming, dumbass. I had an awakening after getting my face smashed in by a bunch of jocks. As I laid there on the sidewalk staring up at the clouds that day, I swore that would be the last time I was ever bullied. That's enough! Let her go! <laughs> what? Hey, look, it's your dark brother. What are you wearing anyway? Nice outfit, Justin Bieber. Are you late for a concert? Hardly. And now I'm about to kick the crap out of both of you. Oh, really? You're gonna fight a couple of girls. What does that make you? I'm Cloud Boy, bitch. Now let's do this. Let's put a hold on that for just one second. I tried to tell my family, but they didn't take me seriously. Nobody did. Well, except my mom. Kind of. Mallory, leave your brother alone. If he wants to be a superhero, that's fine with me. What about you, Steve? Is it all right with you? Hell no. It's the opposite of being all right with me, Diane. Would you lose your friggin' marbles? What's wrong with being a superhero, Dad? Well, they don't exist, son. They're not real. Okay, what do you think? You can just throw on some tights and a cape and go out and start saving the world? Yeah, basically that's my plan. No, you're gonna go to college and you're gonna fail like a normal human being. There's absolutely no reason for you to be out running around wearing that faggy little costume embarrassing the rest of us. No one's gonna know who I am. It's fine. <laughs> it's like trying to teach a blind dog how to whistle here. It's crazy. Leave him alone, Steve. He's fine. Diane, the kid is acting loony. Are you being serious? I'm being a supportive parent. You should try that sometime. Oh, oh, is that right? A supportive parent, huh? Well, it's cute that he's only 15 years old. What if it's not a phase? How are you gonna make a living as a superhero someday? He won't. Right, he won't. He's gonna end up being a 40-year-old unemployed loser, living with his mother, and I won't care because I'll be dead. Good, then I won't have to divorce you. Being a superhero is not about making money. It's about making the world a better place for dorks like Mallory. Look at her face. Don't you want that to stop happening? I thought you said you ran into a door. I lied. Just drink your beer. I have a question. How can you be a superhero if you have no superpowers exactly? What's your plan for that whole thing? Okay, so maybe I can't fly, 
or bend steel with my bare hands, or... Do anything at all extraordinary? That is not true. Your brother happens to have a black belt in judo or something like that. No, no, wait. It's karate. It's neither, Mom. And I'm going to prove that being a superhero is not about what powers you have. It's about using the powers that you've got. That is beautiful, Maxwell. It's crap. I'm with you, Mal. You're an idiot, son. Perfect family, huh? Ever since Mallory and I were little, we've been the ones everybody called weird. Of course, looking back now, I totally get it, but people should feel free to be who they are. So I decided to fight for that freedom. I mean, why not? I'm gonna be a martial arts superhero with some cool gadgets and stuff. Like Batman. Exactly like Batman. You look like your one gay life partner and two white tigers away from being a Vegas act right now. I just don't believe you're being serious. Well, I'm gonna be Clyde Boy, so suck it. And so I was. Cloud Boy. Yeah! fought those two girls, I felt my future as a superhero taking shape. I knew I was doing the right thing. Wow, nerd. Your life sucks. You actually have to live with this psycho? We'll be seeing you at school, nerd. I don't care what they may have said. One thing's for sure. I got their attention. Max? Max? I don't know what good it will do, but I'm telling Mom. Max. Anyway, that's my story. Superheroes are real. And this is where it all began. I'm Cloud Boy.